for the second one. That one is up and good. Lincoln leads 3 0 very early on up across the timeline with Hamelman. Right sideline, Muir. Muir with the ball back out to Hamelman. They swing it around to McKinley. Left side, they go to Riley Hamelman. Back out front, Muir. Kenzie back over to Hamelman. Riley Hamelman circles out front on the dribble. Makes it right side of the floor. Well, a little collision, and I think he's going to get foul against here. Since Lincoln, maybe Sievers. Peyton's in. That'll be here first. First team foul. North Knox will have it out there on the floor. They'll take it out on the far side. Into the corner goes Knuckles right back to Muir in traffic to the left side. Here's McKinley inside. Missed the shot inside. Rebound Knuckles back up. Won't go. Rebound finally ripped down by Sparks. And Carmina walking across the midfloor stripe. Darien with the ball out front. Works right side. Takes it down to the right corner. Stolen right away by Muir. And you got to take care of the basketball when McKenzie Muir is guarding it. Right side. Muir with it out front. Kenzie dumps it out high to Hamelman. Reva with the ball back to Muir on the right wing. Back out from McKinley around the horn to Riley Hamelman. Looking top of the key. Hamelman back right side. Muir open from three. Let's it fly. Rims out. No good. Rebound. Hold down by True Blood. True Blood trying to unload it. Finally gets it to Sievers. Peyton will bring it up. Across the timeline. Lincoln leads 3 0 early on. About two minutes gone by in the contest. Sievers, left side, dump it down inside True Blood, who draws a crowd, kicks it back out. Lang now around the horn, Carmine. Darian back out front, Sievers. Peyton on the dribble, gives it up. Left side, down inside to Lang, draws a crowd, puts it up on the iron, won't go. Rebound pulled down by Knuckles. Clears it off now. Hamelman on the run. Hamelman. Down the right side of the lane, got pushed. That'll be another foul on Seavers. So Peyton's picked up two quick ones. And that'll bring Elena Green off the bench. They'll have it out on the baseline. Muir will inbound it. Still 3 0 ball game. Lincoln Lady. North Knox with the ball out underneath is McKenzie Muir will inbound it. Dumps it in the corner to Knuckles. Back out front, they go to Riley Hamelman. She goes back in the corner to Reva. Reva. Pumps one from 15. It's an air ball pulled out of there by Sparks. And Carmine will bring it up. Darian with the ball. Out front on the dribble. Carmine looking for some movement. Not a whole lot. Now works. Gets it off to Green. Elena back out front. Carmine. Carmine drives it down the left side of the lane. And going to get a foul called on Knuckles, I believe. Wasn't quite there in time. Check it. We on Hamilton. I'm sorry. Reva Hamelman. Her first, team second. Lincoln will have it out on the baseline. Sparks lobs it in the lane, makes the grab in the lane, puts it up off the glass, can't get it. Fights for the rebound, puts it up again, won't go. Tried a third time, still won't go. Rebound, she tries to save it. Out of bounds, it belongs to North Knox. Three chances down in there by Macy Lane. Couldn't get it to go. Still a 3-0 ball game. Gone. Three minutes now into the ball game. Lincoln leading 3 0. Across the timeline with it comes Hamelman. Hamelman out front on the dribble, right side Muir. Kinsey puts it to the floor, kicks it back, wide open is from the right side and burying it is Knuckles. Knuckles, little 13 footer, left her wide open. She put it in the bottom of the well. Lincoln leads 3 2. Across the timeline with it. Lincoln gives it true blood. Now Sparks out high. Sparks down inside. Green's open. Put the shot up. Missed one inside. Rebound Hamelman. Lincoln can't get it to go down in the paint. Hamelman, Riley, hands it off now to Reba. He's out high with it. Hamelman swings it right side. Riley Hamelman pops from 15. It is short of the mark. Rebound True Blood. Comes off now to Carmine. Darien will bring it up across the timeline. 3-2 Lincoln lead. Left side, they swing it out high. True Blood right back. Carmine. Carmine gets it knocked away again by Muir. She's got her hands full with Muir. Weaves through traffic and got fouled. Might have drew off foul from Muir. Let's check and see here. So that'll be the first on McKenzie Muir. Third team foul. Lincoln will have it out. They're into the floor on the far side. It'll be Carmine inbound it. 3-2 Lincoln lead. Carmine looking. Goes way out high to Green. Elena Green on the dribble to the right side. Green on the dribble, 
Looking inside, lobs it down inside. Sparks makes a nice catch, puts it up and in. Not much they could do about that one. Lindsey got ball down inside. No stopping that. 5-2 lead for Lincoln. Here's Reva Hamilton across the timeline with it. Hamilton works right side, dumps it off to Muir. Muir drives in lane, pulls up, shot won't go. Rebound pulled down by Lang. Carbine will bring it up. Lincoln leads 5-2 in the early going. Carbine, right side of the floor, hawked by Muir. Kicks it out front to Green. Lena right back to Carmine. Carmine. Both teams playing man to man. Lob down inside. Lang tries to make the catch. Does make the catch. Puts it up and in. AC Lang hanging with it. Gets the hoop to go. Here's Hamelman on the run to the top of the key. Into the lane. Scoops up a tough shot. And a foul is going to be called on uh, Sparks, I believe. Both her and Carmine were in the area. Nope. I think it's going to be on Carmine. So two free throws coming the way here. Reva Hamilton, good free throw shooter. She's shooting about 75% or so from the line. First one is up and no good. But she had a really nice game this afternoon against Ritter. So Hagen comes in for Riley Hamilton to give her a breather. Another free throw for Reva Hamilton. That one is good. Lincoln leads it 7-3. to three. three minutes to go here in the first quarter. Carmina walking across the midfoot strap. Looks at his zone this time down. Left side it goes. They dump it down inside to Lang. Lang in all kinds of traffic. Throws up a shot. Won't go, but draws the foul. Might be on Knuckles. That would be her first. And at the line, Macy Lang with two shots. First one is up and good. Another one coming her way here. So, freshman toes the stripe for another one. Lang will on the iron. Up with that one and got them both. Lincoln lead at six. Across the timeline, Hamilton. Into lane, pulls up from 10 on the iron, won't go. Rebound, pulled down by Sparks. Gets it off now. Carmine, Carmine will bring it up, link it up by six here in the first quarter. Right side, Elena Green. Dumps it down inside to Lindsay, makes a nice catch, bustles it up and in. Boy, they get, don't have an answer to that at this point. Link it up by eight. Out front with it, Hamelman. Hamelman works to the left side. Hagen on the drive through the lane. Down to the baseline, shot put up, no good. Rebound, Sparks. There's it off, Carmine. Darian will walk it up, 2.05 to go in the first quarter. Lincoln leads 11 to 3. Darian crossed the timeline with it. Works left side of the floor on the dribble, stops, kicks it down into True Blood, it draws a crowd, somehow got it out to Carmine, almost lost it. Carmine drives, scoops it up off the glass, and won't go. Rebound, pulled down by Knuckles. That's going to be a foul on Lang. Macy picks up her first, fourth team foul. And it'll be North Knox with the ball out. McKinley out. Kicks Miller in. For North Knox. Lincoln lead by eight. North Knox with the ball. Minute 46 to go. We're going to see Paige Reese come in here and give... Lindsey Sparks, a breather. Lindsey has been playing well here through this first quarter. It'll be Muir to bring it up across the timeline. McKenzie Muir with the basketball. Works out front on the dribble. Drives it, works it down the lane. Stops, leans in, shot on the iron. Good, nice take by McKenzie Muir. 11-5, Lincoln lead with the ball is Carmine across with a minute 25 to go in the first quarter. Gives it left side, True Blood. Boy, that's not a good pass. Trying to force it down into Lang, and they steal it. Right side, here's Muir, and she saves it. Lost it out of bounds, actually. Tried to save it. Pass was just a little long. So Lincoln gets the ball back. They swap turnovers. Trying to get it in. True Blood, better hurry. Or do something with it. Man, that's just not smart basketball there. Your senior has got to make a better play than that. So back it goes to North Knox. 
And it'll be Muir taking it out on the baseline here for the Lady Warriors. Comes in. Kicks Miller. Out to Hagen. Back to Muir. Knocked away. Stolen by Carmine. Carmine races to the other end. Going to take it to the rack. Going to be offensive foul on Carmine. And that'll be her second. So Carmine gets called for the charge. And back it goes. 11-5, Lincoln lead, but that's second foul on Darian Carmine here in the first quarter. She got into foul trouble this afternoon. Under a minute to go in the first quarter as North walks, North Knox walks it across. Hamelman with the ball out high. Reba with the basketball. Works left side of the floor. That's a five count. Yep, didn't go forward with it. And they returned the turnover. So both these teams turned it over a little bit here in the first quarter. We got to get it back after the turnover. And it'll be Carmine working it across. Works on the dribble against Muir. Hands it off to Green. Elena in traffic. Tough shot. Rims out no good. Rebound Knuckles. Knuckles will clear it off now to Hamelman. Hamelman up across the timeline with it. Reba Hamelman with the ball out front on the dribble. Left side she goes now. Hagen. Hagen. Nice pass over. They get it back out front. Hamelman for three. It's all the way and good. Reba Hamelman getting a good look, and she made the most of it. Buries the three. Lincoln Lee cut in half. Seven seconds to go. Here's Paige Reese with it. Back out. Whip it to Carmine. Three-pointer on the way. It's short. And that'll end the first quarter play. At the end of one, Lady Allison leading by three. It's Lincoln 11. North Knox 8. We're back in 60 seconds here on WZDM. And that's with two fouls is... Peyton Seavers back in. Seavers playing with two fouls. Across the timeline comes Hamelman. Out. Go. Riley Hamelman is back in. Reba with it on the right wing. Puts it over the right side. Knuckles down the baseline. Dumps it back out to Hamelman. Hamelman open from 16. It's on the way. Got another one. That one just inside the three-point line. And they pulled within pull. a point. Lincoln led at one time by eight. Now here's Seavers, hawked by Muir. Gets it off to Green. Back out to Seavers. Seavers brings it over to True Blood out high. True Blood down the inside. Boy, nice catch by Green. Lena puts it up and got it. Boy, that's a nice bucket by Green. The other end here comes Hamelman quickly. Back out front, they go to Muir. Way out high to McKinley. They can lead by three here in the first half. Riley Hamelman with it. Drives it down to the baseline, cut off, picks up the dribble, kicks it out. Kinley from 16 out front. Off the iron, no good. Ball swatted away by Hamelman, but ends up in the hands of Seavers. They will bring it up across the timeline. Right side they go. True blood. Now Sparks, Sparks left side of the key, brings it over to Seavers. Three on the way by Peyton. Will not go. Rebound fought for. Pulled down by Hamelman. Here's Reva Hamelman on the run with it. Drives it down the right side of the lane. Leans in. Shot on the way and good. She's feeling it. Reba Hamelman on a roll. Lincoln lead a one. Across the timeline with it. Seavers. Peyton out front. Hawked by Muir. Knocked away by Muir. Out of bounds. Still along to Lincoln. Seavers will nope, they'll have True Blood take it out in front of the North Knox bench. And Lincoln's into the floor. True Blood. Looking, dumps it out high to Green. Playing a Green with a basketball out front. Hands it off to True Blood. Chassis will circle out front on the dribble. Kicks over to Green. Green lobs it inside. And they're over to steal it away. It's Hamelman. Hamelman pushes it down the floor. North Knox trying to take their first lead. Hamelman will get fouled, I think, before the shot. And if it's Sievers, I think that'll be her third foul. The so Sievers picks up her third. That's going to be... Amy Lang off the bench. Uh, Seavers and Carmine, the starting guards on the bench for Lincoln with foul problems. That's going to bring Kix Miller off the bench here for North Knox. She will come in for Knuckles to give Knuckles a breather. North Knox will have it out on the baseline. You're already inbounded. The Warriors trying to take their first lead of the contest. Dump it over to McKinley. McKinley out front on the left side with it. McKinley on the dribble. Directs a little traffic, kicks over to the left side. Here's Riley Hamelman on the baseline. She walked. 
Lincoln will take it back the other way. Little pressure now. They get it into Green. Elena Green quickly up the sideline. Green. All kinds of pressure. Put it up. Missed it. Rebound Lang. Missed it. Sparks. Missed it. Very good rebound again. Lang finally got it to go. Third time to charm. Now comes Hamilton with it. Lincoln leads by three. Or even with the ball out front. She's been feeling it. Takes it to the right side. Stops. Kicks it out front. Here's Riley Hamilton for three. It's wide left. Rebound comes off the line. Macy Lang gets it off now to Green. Lane will bring it up across the timeline. 5 12 to go. We're in the first half. Lincoln leading by three. Green on the dribble. Lobs it down side of Lane. There's no way that's getting in there. Ball's loose, picked up, and a foul's going to be called on Sparks, I believe. So, Lindsay, I think, a foul on that one. Check who they give it to. There's no way that's, that ball should have got in there from Green. One on one time here for North Knox. So, timeout called. 15 12 Lincoln leads. We're back in 60 seconds here on WZDM and WZDM.com. Muir there, but Muir wasn't the first who was fouled. Uh, I think officials caught that one. Tried to sneak Muir in there. They're going to have shooting the free throws here. Kicksmiller, I think, will be at the line here. So Katie Kicksmiller shooting the one-on-one. -on -one. First one on the way, and no good. Rebound, True Blood. Gets it off now to Green. Lincoln leading by three. Under five minutes going first half. Lincoln will both their starting guards on the bench with foul problems. True Blood back out to Green. Around the horn to come to Kaylee Lang. Lang back out to Green. Green swings it over to True Blood. True Blood kicks it back out to Green. Lena on the dribble. Takes it back out front. Top of the key, Lang. Lob down to the basement. Boy, Lincoln, you want to go down inside, but you just can't keep forcing it. And they throw another one away. So back the other way with it. Comes North Knox. Three-point Lincoln lead. 426 to go here in the first half. Cross the timeline with it. Muir. Muir on the dribble. Down to the baseline. Here's McKinley from 12. Shot rattles out of there. No good. Boy, that did everything but go in. Rebound Lang. Here comes Lady Alzes with the basketball. Green with the ball out front. Gives it out high. True blood. True blood back out to Green. Way out high to Lang. Macy Lang way out front with it. Now to True Blood. Down inside Sparks. Over they go to Lang. She'll try a three. It's going to be short. Rebound pulled out of there by McKinley. McKinley double team but gets it off to Muir. Muir on the run through traffic. Takes it inside. Put it up. No good. Rebound loose inside. Track down in the corner by Sparks. And Muir is down holding an ankle to the other end. Here's Lang off the glass and good. Macy Lang gets the bucket and... Muir is down at the other end. Boy, you hate to see that. She's tough, but uh, she ran into Sparks, and uh, Sparks was not a giving object. It's for the basketballs. We come back to action. Wow, there's a push right there. That just is not a smart foul by Elena Green. Just running right up the backside of Hamilton, who's going to go to the line at the other end with a one-on-one. Hamilton, one of two from the line. She's got eight points, eight of their 12 points. So she'll be at the line. Senior. Eyes the iron. Tosses on the way. Missed that one. Rebound Sparks. Gets it off now. The green, Elena, walk it up. 324 to go here in the first half. Lincoln leads by five. Down the way. Green to the rack. Throws up a wild shot. Rebound, though, comes off Kaylee Lang. Out to Sparks. Back down inside. True Blood wide open. Shot up and good. Chasty gets the two. Timeout one by Lincoln. 310 to go here in the first half. Lincoln leads 19-12. We're back in 30 seconds here on WZDS. Hagan looking, looking, still looking, still looking. Ball knocked away. Out of bounds. Last touch by Kaylee Lang. Good effort by Kaylee. 
North Knox will take it out on the side in the backcourt. Now McKinley will inbound it this time. And Lincoln peeling back and give it off now to Hamelman. Hamelman will bring it up across the timeline. Reva with a good first half. Swings it right side, Riley Hamelman. Riley drives it in the lane, stand, got it partially blocked. Controlled by Lang. Paige Brees. Here's Green with it. Lena Green out front now. Comes over to Kaylee Lang. Back to Green. Lena out front with the basketball. He's out high. True blood. Across the floor. Paige Brees. Paige dumps it back out to Green. Lena backs it out of the dribble. Out around mid floor. Two minutes to two and a half minutes to go in the half. Green will split the defense. Runner on the way. Off the iron. No good. Rebound pulled out of there by McKinley. Addison on the run with it. Stops out front. Leaves it back now to Rita Hamelman. Hamelman down to the baseline to Riley. Riley, nice shot fake in traffic. Too many green shirts there. Kicks it across. Here's Hagen, who got fouled. Kaylee Lang will put her on the line. So Lang picks up her second. Nice job by Riley Hamelman. Getting out a little traffic. And at the line will be... It's Robbie Hagan. Average about three points ball game off the bench for North Knox. And she will let the first one go. And off the back of the iron, no good. Another toss coming her way. Lincoln lead by seven here. And another toss here. For North Knox. Tosses on the way. And boy, missed the ball. That one way down in wouldn't stay. True blood with a rebound. Off it comes Elena Green. Elena with the ball out front. Two minutes to go here in the first half. Lincoln leads by seven. Green dribbles around out front. Brings it across. Brees. Brees, tough shot. That's not going to go. Rebound to Lang. Put it up. No good. Rebound pulled down by North Knox. Couple wild shots that time down the floor by Lady Alces. Down in the corner. Wide open from three. Hamelman won't go this time. That was Riley Hamelman. Hagan, though, gets a rebound. Does it back out to McKinley. McKinley will bring it out front. Riley Hamelman on the triple. Takes it in the lane. Now down to the baseline. Here's shot put up by North Knox. No good. Kicks Miller. Miss it. Rebounds loose on the floor. It's tied up. The arrow belongs to Lincoln. And we'll see Carmine and Katie Drake come in here for Green and Kaylee Lane. Lake will have it out of the backcourt, leading 19 to 12, with a minute 23 to go here in the first half. So Carmine will bring it up the floor. Darien with a basketball, with a minute 20 to go here in the first half. Carmine direct a little traffic out front. Works over the right side. Lang Lang drives inside, spin off the glass and good. Macy Lang. To the other end, here comes Hamelman. Reba from 16, it's on the way, it's no good. Rebound though, Hagen back up, no good. Rebound loose in the lane, picked up by North Knox again. Foul on True Blood. The North Knox will go to the stripes, it'll be McKinley at the line. It's about 71% from the stripe, does Addison. Lincoln with their biggest lead right now, nine points, but McKinley at the line with two shots. Double bonus time, first one on the way, good. Her first point of the night. And coming in will be Sparks now for Paige Breeze. And another toss coming the way here, McKinley. So Annis McKinley will tow the stripe. Let's that one go, and she nets them both. Only going to bring it up the floor with 54 seconds going half, leading by seven. Carmine brings it across the timeline. Darian with the ball out front. Carmine works right side of the floor. Carmine hawked out front. Works on the dribble. Leaves out high to True Blood. True Blood down the right side. Lob inside. Spark somehow got it up amongst three players and drew the foul. So Lindsay will go to the line for the first time tonight. 68% free throw shooter. And two coming her way here. Let's see Elena Green come in here in a moment. All right, come in for Carmine. Get her out of there before she can pick up her third foul. Sparks knocks down the first one. So Carmine to the bench and Green back in with 35 seconds to go here in the half. Another free throw coming the way here. Lindsey Sparks. So 
Miles Parks will eye the iron for the second one. That one on the way and got them both. Nicely done by Sparks. Macy Lang will come to the bench and Kaylee Lang will come in for her. And North Knox will bring it up to the floor. Lincoln leading by nine with 35.6 seconds to go here in the first half. Reva Hamelman will walk it up across the mid-floor stride. Hamelman down to the baseline to Riley, who's open. Her shot is short, sneaking in there and getting a rebound. Those knuckles, and her shot blocked, and she is fouled on the floor. Boy, nobody put a body on knuckles, and she snuck in there and got the rebound, and then Lincoln ended up fouling her. Foul is on Sparks. It's her first foul at the line. Ruthann Knuckles. She had two points in the ball game. Eyes the iron for the first one. On the way with it. And no good. Uh, Knuckles with another one. Carmine back in with 21 seconds to go. So put her back in for the offense. And another toss here for Knuckles. That one is up. That one is no good. Rebound Sparks. Clears it off to Carmine. Up across the timeline with it. 14 seconds to go here in the first half of play. Lincoln up 23-14. Six seconds to go. Carmine, step back three on the way. Will not go. Rebound. And that will end the first half of play. Lady House has go to locker room leading by nine. It's Lincoln 23. North Knox for playing. And North Fox will start the quarter with basketball as Hagen will bring it across the timeline. On the right side, picked up by Hamelman, Riley Hamelman, into Knuckles. Now off to Reva Hamelman, short with a shot, a rebound pulled down by True Blood. Gets it off now to Carmine. Carmine across the timeline with it. Darian with the ball to the right side. Carmine on the right wing with it. Looking inside, got it knocked away, kicked away by Hamelman. It'll still belong to. Rather, Hagen kicked it away. It's still belong to Lincoln. True ball take it out. And Lincoln's into the floor on the far sideline. Into the back quarter goes Carmine. And Carmine will bring it across. Just underway in the third quarter. Lady House leading by nine. Right side, True Blood. Dump it down inside Sparks. Makes the catch. Throws it up. Can't finish it. And rebound pulled down by Knuckles. Back the other end here comes Reba Hamelman. Hamelman, nice crossover move. Puts it up. Nice take to the hoop by Reba Hamelman. A lot falls on her shoulders right now. Cuts the Lincoln lead to seven. Across the timeline with Carmine. Darian looking at his own defense. He'll just stand out there and dribble. Stand in the center circle area. Well, North Knox sits back in the zone. Lincoln looking to the bench for instructions from Coach Connor. And Carmine, no count on her, so she... Dribble away out there. Now, almost lost it for a moment. Stops, kicks the cross floor. Sievers from three. It's on the way. Got it. That'll work against that zone. Peyton Sievers buries a three. Lincoln up by 10, their biggest lead. Here's Hamelman with the ball out front. Reva Hamelman leaves it off now to Riley Hamelman. She drives it down to the baseline. Here's McKinley from 15. Buries it. Nicely done. Addison McKinley with a bucket. Lincoln leads 26 to 18. Carmine will bring it up. Once again, they drop back into the zone. Carmine, right side of the floor, down inside. Tough catch by True Blood, tied up down inside by Hamelman. And an arrow, I believe, points away of the Lady Houses. Green will come in for Seavers, and True Blood will take it out underneath after being tied up. Dumps it into Lang. Boy, that's lost into the hands of Hamelman. Hamelman takes it down the right side, pulls up off the glass, short with it. Rebound, Chassis True Blood. She got it knocked away, stole away, and then blocked a shot of Hagen. Hagen in trouble on the floor. She walked. Nope, they called timeout in time. North Knox calls timeout to save the possession. 26 18, Lincoln leads. We're back in 30 seconds here on WZDM. WZDM. Coach Muir calling a timeout. Comes into Hagen. She kicks it back out front with the ball. Reva Hamelman. Lincoln now into his zone. Hamelman 
Out front on the dribble. Swings it over to Riley Hamilton. Riley with the ball. Works it across for Eva. Down in the corner. Hagen drives. Shot blocked from behind by laying out of bounds. It'll still belong to North Knox. So taking it out on the baseline will be McKinley. McKinley inbounds it in the corner. Here's Hamilton open. Won't go. Rebound, though. Reba Hamilton. Reba will back it out now. Another opportunity here for North Knox. Link it up by eight. North Knox with a basketball. Riley Hamilton over to Reva. Reva Hamilton puts it to the floor. Works on the dribble. Across the floor they go now. There's Riley Hamilton. Stops. Picks up the dribble. Kicks it down to Hagen from the baseline. Shot up and good. Lincoln lead. Trimmed to six. Was well, ten. That's the timeline with it. Carmine. Carmine. The ball out high, works it left side to Green. Back out to Carmine, and they go over to Lang. Down inside, got True Blood wide open for an easy two. Nicely done. Lincoln back up to an eight-point lead, 425 to go in the third. Reva Hamelman crossed the timeline. Bumped out front by Green. Lane to Green. Pick up her second foul. Be out of bounds to the... Lady Warriors still have it at their end of the floor. Taking it out on the far sideline will be Riley Hamelman. So Hamelman looking in battle. The backcourt goes to Reva Hamelman, who will bring it across. Hamelman with the ball out front, looking man to man this time. Kick it off. Driving. Riley Hamelman leans in, shot partially blocked, but he ends up with the hands of Knuckles, who puts it up and in. Good hustle by Ruth Ann Knuckles. Lincoln lead at six. In the lane, Carmine dances one on the air and won't go. Rebound foul over the back. It's going to be Sparks, I think. So Lindsey Sparks picks up her second. All right now, momentum's wearing white. Lincoln a little flat right now. North Knox has crawled to within six, and they have the basketball with 3.54 to go. So Reba Hamilton will bring it up the floor. Hamelman with the ball out high. Works left side of the floor in the dribble. Kicks it out front. McKinley. McKinley from three. Won't go. Follows. Uh, Knuckles gets the rebound. Back out to McKinley. Back to Riley Hamelman. Hamelman out high on the dribble. Works left side. Kicks it over now. Hagen. Hagen at the foul line. Cut off. Kicks it back out front. Now Riley Hamelman with it. Stops in the lane. Kicks it back out. Hagen. Down to the baseline, Knuckles. Knuckles, back out. Hamelman. Hamelman down to McKinley. Same spot. That one won't go, though. Way down in and out. And Lincoln comes down with a rebound. Comes off to Carmine. That one just missed sticking down there for North Knox that time. Three minutes to go in the third quarter. Carmine with the ball out on the right wing. Darian with the basketball. Six-point Lincoln lead. Carmine out front. Trueblood's going to try a three. That's no good. And we'll rebound North Knox. Up across the timeline with it comes Riley Hamelman. Hamelman walks it across. Works on the dribble. Drives it down to the baseline. McKinley. McKinley fakes. Got the ball knocked away, but picked up by Knuckles. Knuckles down on the baseline. Cut off. Kicks it back out to McKinley. McKinley will reset things here for the Lady Warriors, who... Trail by six with 2.20 to go here in the third quarter. Kinley drives and lost the ball right out of bounds. Back the other way. It'll go to Lincoln. So Lady House is looking for a spark. They look a little flat right now. Carmine will bring it across the timeline. Six point Lincoln lead. He's out front of Green. Elena Green. Back out. Carmine, Carmine on the dribble, works through traffic, throws up a wild shot, won't go, but called for traveling. Back the other way, North Knox will bring it. Lady Warriors will bring it up with Reva Hamelman. Bring it across the timeline. Hamelman with the ball, right side, 
Hagan from 16. Won't go, but got fouled by Sparks. Way at, boy, just a silly foul. Sparks picks up her third. And Hagan's going to be at the line here. Two points for her so far in the ball game. At the line with two shots. Eyes the iron. First one is on the way and rattles in good. Another one coming her way. Here's Kicks Miller in to give Knuckles a breather. Another toss here for Hagen. A chance to pull them within four. That one on the way and won't go. Rebound Sparks. Sparks with three fouls now. Clears it off to Carmine. Minute 40 to go in the third quarter. Lincoln up by five. It's been as many as ten. Here's Green with it. Almost walked. Back out front. Carmine. Carmine backs it out. Works on the dribble. Down inside. Sparks open for the easy two. Nice dish from Carmine. The Sparks for the bucket. 30-23. Minute 18 to go in the third. North Knox with the ball. Here's Hamelman. Leaves it off now to Hagen. Hagen takes it. Foul line. Shot on the way. Way down in and out. Rebound. Sparks got fouled by Kicksmoor. So Katie Kicksmiller picks up her first foul. Winkle will take it out in the backcourt. Leading by seven with a minute seven to go here in the third quarter. And Carmine will bring it up the floor. Daring across the mid-fourth stride. Man to man defense by North Knox. Give it over to True Blood. Dump it down inside to Sparks. Sparks turn around shot on the iron. Dance is off no good. Rebound, Macy Lang had it. It's loose in the lane. It's tied up here. It's going to belong to North Knox. So Lady Warriors will have the basketball. Back the other way. North Knox will bring it. Seven-point Lincoln lead with 50 seconds to go here in the third quarter. Bring it up across the timeline. Riley Hamelman. Hamelman with the ball. Drives it. Kicks it over the right side to Reva. Reva. On the dribble, brings it back out front. Hamelman with the ball. 29 seconds to go in the quarter. Reva pulls up from outside, shot on the iron, dances in good. Reva Hamelman makes it a five-point deficit. Lincoln leading by five with 16 seconds to go. Carmine will bring it across. Hand it out high to Green. Green weaves, takes it to the hole, and is fouled on the way to the iron. Well, I'll have to earn him from the stride, but uh, that's not one of her favorite spots. She is shooting 46% from the free throw line. So she will shoot two. First one on the way, and there we go. Nicely done. She has really got to get consistent at the line because she has got some great quickness. Can get to the hole. It's going to be fouled a lot. Both uh, Carmine and Sparks go to the bench as Brees and Drake come in. That one way down in and out. Rebound comes off. North Knox, they race up the floor. Hamelman right side. Hagen back out to Reva Hamelman. She'll let fly from three-point land. It's wide. Rebound Lang, and that'll end the third quarter play at the end of three. Lady Alice is leading. It's 31-25. Lincoln leading at the end of three. Not so much for Lincoln. Carmine will bring it across the timeline. Darien with a basketball. Works on the dribble. Takes it. Well, lost the handle on it, but Lang, well, still loose. They dive in after it, and ball's going to belong to North Knox. Lincoln turns it over. That was pretty much unforced. So North Knox will take it out. Inbound it, and up for Riley Hamelman. Lincoln leading 31-25 here early in the fourth. Hamelman, Hagen, Hagen works it from the foul line, puts it up. It's short. Rebound Sparks. Lindsay will hand it off now to Carmine, and Darian will bring it up the floor. Carmine crossed the timeline with it. Hands it out now. Green, green right corner. True blood. Back out to Green. Green, nothing going inside. Wisely takes it back out to Carmine. Carmine will back it out on the dribble. Darian takes it left side, stops, kicks it in the corner. Macy Lang right back to Carmine. 
North Knox sagging back on Sparks inside, wisely so. Carmine will take it back out. Darian dribbles out front. No count on her. Works over the right side to Green. Elena Green weaves through traffic, takes the rack, missed the shot. Rebound, Macy Lang back up, won't go, but she's fouled. And we'll have to earn them from the line. I think Knuckles will be the guilty party here. So Macy Lang will go to the line. Second foul on Knuckles, and at the line, Macy Lang. Shooting two. First one is on the way, and no good. She's another one who needs to work on the free throw shooting. And she goes on in her career here because she's going to be somebody who gets the line a lot. She shoots 63%. Eyes the iron for the second one. Missed them both. Rebound, North Knox. 31-25. Lincoln with the lead. North Knox with the basketball. Reba Hamilton up with 6.35 to go. Hamilton gets a pick out front. Open for three. Let's it fly. Buries it. So Hamilton with her second three. Cuts the Lincoln lead in half. 31-28. Lady Houses are flat as a pancake right now. Here's Green, runner in the lane, on the iron, won't go. Rebound, Sparks, no good. Rebound, Lang over the back. Macy Lang picks up the rebound foul. And you're going to see Seavers come in here for who? Macy Lang. And here comes North Knox, chance to tie it with a three. North Knox digging down. Saw their leading score go down with an injury, but they come out here in the second half, played very well. They've had the better of it. Here's a nice move by Hamelman, but kicks it back out front. Gives it to McKinley, back out to Hamelman. Reba Hamelman with the ball out front, works on the dribble. Stops, kicks it to Riley Hamelman in the corner. Riley puts it to the floor, drives it into the lane, down to the baseline. Here's Knuckles from the baseline. Air ball pulled out of there by... True blood. Had the good look, just hurt it a little bit. Three-point lead for the Lady Houses. Carmine brings it across. Leaves it out front to Green. Right side it goes. Seavers deep three by Peyton. Won't go. Rebound. Fought for. Loose. Tied up. Uh, arrow belongs to Lincoln. So uh, North Knox doing a great job holding their own on the boards against the bigger Lincoln lineup. Lincoln gets it with the arrow going their way, so it'll be, well, first one to have timeout for North Knox. 5.27 to go. Lincoln hanging on to a three-point lead over North Knox. We are back in 30 seconds, second half. North Knox has been playing some inspired basketball. Carmine will take it out on the baseline. Darian waiting, still waiting, still waiting, still waiting. Goes out high to Seavers. Seavers. Leave it back to Carmine. Carmine with the ball. Drives it through traffic. Throws one up. Won't go. Rebound laying up and good. Boy, people going down hard. Carmine went down hard. Also, I think that was Hamelman who went down, down hard. They're both back up. Well, and Lang got fouled on the shot, so a chance to three-point play here for Macy. So Riley Hamelman gets her first foul. Free throw here for Macy Lang. It is on the way. That one is good. About the count of the hoop. Yeah, okay. It'll be North Knox ball out of bounds. Sparks is coming in for Seavers. Lincoln leads by six with 5.18 to go here in the contest. North Knox will bring it up. And Reba Hamilton across the timeline. He leaves it to the left side of Riley, back to Reba. Reba puts it to the floor, gets a pick, dumps it back to Knuckles. Knuckles walked. Trying to get a hail when somebody crossed right in front at the last moment. She ended up walking with it. Here's Kicksmiller in for Knuckles. Lincoln will take it out of the backcourt, leading 34-28, 5.03 to go. Comes in to Green. Green races it down the right side. Elena... And inside Sparks. Sparks is fouled on the pass. He out of bounds for Lincoln on the baseline. So it'll be triple on the inbounded. 
underneath the Lincoln bucket. Jassy dumps it in the lane, puts it up off the glass, too strong. Rebound pulled out there by North Knox. It's kind of hustle. Rushed the shot that time, did Lang. Here's Hamelman out front with it. Reva Hamelman on the dribble out high. Gets a pick. Works lost the handle on it, but retrieves it on the sideline. Reva with the ball. Hands it out and into the backcourt. And it's tough, though, by True Blood. So still North Knox ball. McKinley gets it, brings it across. Addison hands it out front to Reva Hamelman. Back to Addison McKinley. Open from 17, buries it. McKinley with a bucket. Lincoln lead of four with 4.18 to go. Across the timeline with it. Carmine. Carmine hands it out to Green. Green right corner, True Blood. Jasty back out high. Lane of Green to Lang. Lang takes it on the run off the glass and good. Macy Lang puts it in the bottom of the well. To the other end, here's Hamelman. Reba Hamelman gets a pick out front. Pulls up, and we got an offensive foul. Nope, I think it's a foul on Lincoln trying to fight for your pick. And Carmine picks up the foul. That's her third foul. Ball be out of bounds to North Knox. 36-30, Lincoln leads, 3.50 to go. North Knox has it out of underneath. Dumps it into Riley Hamelman. She dumps it out front now. Hagen back in the corner, McKinley. McKinley back to Hagen, open from three. She lets it fly. It's no good. Rebound Sparks. Sparks clears off to Carmine. 3.37 to go. Lincoln will walk it up. Leading by six. Darian crosses the timeline with it. Works left side of the floor on the dribble. Carmine. Hawked out front by Hagen. Gives it out down to Lang. Lang stands out high with the basketball. Now, hands it off to Carmine. Darian will bring it back out to the center circle area. Carmine works it down the right side. Dumps it in the corner. True blood. True blood on the dribble. Stops. Kicks it over to Green. Laying it. Nice pass inside for Sparks for two. That was nicely done. Timeout one by North Knox. 3.03 to go here in the ballgame. Lincoln leads 38-30. We're back in 30 seconds. So North Knox will bring it up. And Reba Hamelman, who's had a nice ball game, will bring it across. Hamelman out front on the dribble. Stops, kicks over the left side. Work it to McKinley. Back they go to Hamelman. Reba with the ball out front. They'll reset things. Hamelman kicks it over now. Hagen. Hagen. Down the left side, McKinley. McKinley back out front. Riley Hamelman. Riley Hamelman knocked away by Carmine with a steal. Darian races to the other end, takes it, scoops it up. Got it to go, and she's going to the line. Threw one up, and it just creeped over the rim and dropped through, and she'll have a chance at the three-point play. I believe Hagen, the guilty party, on the foul. So Carmine with five points on the night will beat the line. Shooting one. So Darian eyes the iron for the free throw. It is up and good. And Lincoln matching, well, their biggest lead now. They've had the ball game. They're up by 11 with 2.28 to go. Across the timeline, Hamelman works left side of the floor on the dribble. Kicks it out front. McKinley back to Hamelman. Hamelman weaves through traffic, pulls up, shot up. No good. Rebound through blood. Kicks it off now to Carmine. And Darian will take her time bringing it up. Lincoln leading by 11 with 2.07 to go. Across the timeline with it, Carmine. Dumps it in the key. Down Sparks to Lang and keeps it in. Macy Lang rolled it all over the rim and it falls in. And Lincoln now with their biggest lead, 43-30. Minute 50 to go. Hamelman with the ball out front. Down in the corner. They go. Ball knocked away by Carmine. Out of bounds. Still belong to North Knox. Hamelman will take it out in front of their bench. North Knox into the floor. Comes into Knuckles. Back to Hamelman. Three on the way. It's an air ball. Loose in the uh, down inside to get it to Knuckles. And puts it up from five, and it's good. So Ruth Ann Knuckles gets the hoop. Lincoln leads 43-32 with minute 25 to go. Carmine crossed the timeline with it. Darian out high on the dribble. Works it left side. Backs out on the dribble now. Guarded by Hagen. Carmine still with the ball. Kicks it off, and Lincoln wants a timeout. 
Minute 10 to go, and it's a 43-32 ball game. Lincoln leading. We're back in 30 seconds here on WZDM. Double shift. Carmine will take it out on the side. Lincoln's into the floor. Dumps it into Sparks. Right back to Darien. Darien down to the baseline. Circle back out front. Double teamed out front. Carmine bumped by Hamelman. And a one-on-one here for Carmine. Darien with six points tonight. Oops, it's not one-on-one one yet. Be out of them. That's, that's not against, uh, is it seventh team foul against North Knox? Yeah, okay. Now they got it. So now Carmine will go to the line, shooting the one-on-one. Seventh team foul against Lady Warriors. So Darien at the line, shooting the one-on-one. Carmine will eye the iron for the first one. Sophomore lets it fly and got it. Another one coming her way. Bumps the lead to a dozen. Carmine with another one. That one is up. Got them both. Lincoln leads 45 32 with a minute to go as Hamelman will bring it across. Lob to the right side, Riley Hamelman. Ball deflected, loose on the floor, still loose on the floor. Green comes up with it, but I think she walked. Nope. Lincoln called a timeout before the walk. So Lincoln will still have the basketball, and uh, we'll just keep it to go. Taking it out on the side. Lead pass up the floor. Green breakaway, put it up, and he missed it. Wow. Fortunately, this point, there's going to be a hurting anything. Hamelman. Over to Hagen. Hagen from the baseline. Shots an air ball pulled down by Lang. It'll come back to Carmine with 34 seconds to go. Lady Alts is in control at 45-32. Carmine will back it out. Just dribble out for a Lincoln fans coming to their feet. Carmine can just dribble it out and run the clock down. Carmine. 12 seconds to go. North Knox applying no pressure. Lincoln will just has to dribble it out. Carmine with it. And time runs down and that ends it. Lincoln will repeat for the third straight year. They will be back after this two-minute timeout here on WZDM, WZDM.com. What do you want for Christmas this year? What do you need for Christmas this year? Shoes and boots are a common forgotten item on that Christmas list, so I'm here to remind you. Hi, this is Tracy from Grunman's, 906 North 7th Street, Vincennes. And whether it's a new pair of shoes for work, for going out, or just for fun, be sure everyone knows that you want a new pair of shoes from Grunman's this year. And if you can't decide between Red Wing, Tony Llama, Clark's, New Balance, Sacks, Grunman Shoes on North 7th Street in Vincennes. Ileana Irrigation, your full-service rain key dealer. McDonald's on 6th Street and Hart Street in Vincennes. Overhead Door Company of Vincennes, serving Knox and surrounding counties for more than 40 years. Thorn Auto, CBJ, Rusty or Sherry, 9th of Main in downtown Vincennes. Stay tuned now for the Smith Electric Post Game Show. Coming your way in just a moment here on WZDM. <laughs> Time now for the Smith Electric Post Game Show here on WZDM. Smith Electric, for dependability and workmanship you can count on, Smith Electric. And we'll be back with stats and the coaches' interview right after this from Smith Electric. Here's Dustin Smith from Smith Electric. I worked with my dad growing up, so I already knew quite a bit about electrical work before going through my education, the military, and my apprenticeship. We value the trust and responsibilities our customers put in us, so we make sure every job is done right. Smith Electric, from minor repairs to large installations. Jerry Smith and Dustin Smith, for dependability and workmanship you can count on. Call 743-2588.
Right. And back we are at Alice Arena. Lady Alice's win the McDonald's Holiday Hoops Championship, uh, beating North Knox 45-32. Join us right now, head coach Travis Connor. And the usual ball game with uh, North Knox, Knox, you know it's going to be a battle. You look at a double-digit ending, but uh, they were right within three there uh, late and well, early in the fourth quarter, I believe. Yeah, I mean, I mean, anytime you get county rivals, um, I mean, same thing last year. Um, you know, regular season's one thing. You got time to prepare and all that other stuff. Tournament atmosphere, tournament situations. You're surviving in advance of that next game, and you just want to find a way to get the W. And that's the only thing I wrote on the board in the pregame uh, over there right before we came out on the clipboard was just a W. So that's all you want tonight. Forget style points. Forget it all. Go get a W. Find a way to do it. And the quote we talked about in the locker room was, champions find a way to get it done. And, and that's what they did. And, and, and so proud of them. So proud of the effort, Dave. Yeah, I thought third quarter a little flat. And uh, North Knox, I think they had a little uh, spark. They were trying to, you know, have fight back after McKenzie went down. And uh, uh, they got going a little bit there in the third quarter. But able to weather that storm and the, Never gave up a lead. Yeah, I, I, you're right. And I, you know, credit North Knox for not going away. Credit Reva Hamelman. Yeah. I mean, I think that kid's been playing for 10 years. Dave. <laughs> so, so many headaches. Uh, Try to figure out how to defend her because she's tough to defend. She's one of the, as I told you in the pregame, one of the best basketball players um, we go against year in, year out. She's all around kid. Shoot the three ball, pull up Jay, get the ball to the basket. So smart out there. Makes a great read on every mm -hmm. ball screen. We go under, she drills it, we go. We, we fight through over the top, she goes around. I mean, she's just heads, heads up basketball player. She carried them in that third quarter and, and, oh, yeah. and, and really kind of just made that thing a game. And, and, you know, I'm just real happy our kids didn't fold. It would have been easy at that point. And, you know, they're, they're playing without McKenzie. We're playing without Allison. And it's kind of a, a, a toss up there. Yeah. Next, huh. next man up, someone right. can come out and get the job done. And we found a way to get it done. And uh, when they made that run back, he kind of, spread the floor a little bit and got things open in the middle and got some buckets that really got you going. Yeah, that's it. And, you know, our dribble drive, when we go to that, I mean, obviously an option out there is to attack the rim off the bounce mm -hmm. and, and with Darian and Lena and Macy, Allison when she's up there. Um, but, but the other thing is that opens up, you know, that, that post situation for us. We try to do a lot of our normal stuff and credit Steve. Coach Knight over there does a great job scouting. Uh, um, and, you know, they're going to try to take away some things and, we thought we had a good counter for that. We just doing, didn't do a very good job getting that ball to the backside like we'd want. Mm -hmm. um, so, so, so we, you know, plan A doesn't work. Go to plan B, and plan B doesn't work. Keep go, keep looking for one that does. And I thought we did a real good job late. Um, you know, one spreading the floor, and then and then two trying to take advantage of, of Macy that down low mm -hmm. and, and finding her in that four out one in situation. But just credit our girls for adapting to what we're talking about over there on the sideline late in the game too. Macy Lang, a real good uh, tournament for you, 15, 20, and then 17 points tonight. Yeah, 15, 20, 17 points, and uh, we got her right now with 20 rebounds. In this game? In this game. Wow. Um, you know, we The rebounding, you know, uh, unofficial, of course, so I look at that tape. It's always unofficial. Yeah. I see the tape, Dave. <laughs> uh, but, but right now we, we got a 48 to 26 advantage on the boards. Macy with 20 of those. Lindsay, Lindsay Sparks had, had 10 of those. And Chassie Trueblood had 10 of those. So yeah. three kids in double digits on the boards really took care of it. Almost every possession on the boards. And, and like you said, Macy just, even when she didn't have a great game, you look up 17 and 20. Yeah. That's a, that's a pretty good game. It is. And then uh, once again, though, Carbine and uh, Seavers get into foul trouble early. But once again, go to the bench and uh, didn't get some points from people off the bench, but they came in and did the job. Yeah, that Kaylee they Lane came in and she didn't get minutes a lot, Dave. And yeah. She, she never complains. She just comes and does her stuff and came in and, and battled out there on the defensive end. And Katie Drake, same thing. Paige Breeze, same thing again. Mm -hmm. um, and, of course, Elena does right. her thing. And, and, you know, just just an all-around effort and, and we'll just cannot be happier for a group of young ladies that just worked and got the thing done tonight. Cannot be happier for them. And uh, you're in kind of a situation you don't get very much time off because you're right back at it next uh, Wednesday night when you go up to Bloomfield. Right. Yeah, we'll take, we'll obviously. You're going to give next... Christmas off? Yes, we're going to give. <laughs> Peyton Seavers asked me that the other day. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're, we'll give them obviously the next two days, you know, off. And we'll come in late on, on Tuesday, get a let them get back from mm -hmm. town with their family and all that stuff. Go a little bit on Tuesday, come back, walk through on, on Wednesday and head up to Bloomfield and, and, you know, be ready to play. But, you know, obviously, we always want to be make sure we're 100% ready for a game. But at the same time, it's family time. Let sure. them go do that. 
and then then after that we can give them some more days off and, and let them enjoy that New Year's Eve stuff and, and and then we'll come back ready to work after the New Year. Well, the bottom line of these three games in this tournament are just team play. Team play. So many different aspects of it too, from defensive end to the offensive end to the rebounding end. I, I just happy, just happy for them, Dave. Happy with them, and and, and so pleased and, and thrilled to see see the joy in their faces. Well, congratulations, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Dave. Thanks for covering a lot of basketball games yeah, the last yeah. couple of days. But just a few. All right, yeah. Merry Christmas. You too. Friend. Thanks. As uh, Travis Connor with us, the Lady Houses win the tournament here, the McDonald's Holiday Hoops tournament. And uh, we'll be back. Check the scoring right after this timeout from Smith Electric. Here's Jerry Smith from Smith Electric.